Hello friends. Good morning. Today I am going to explore a very small but important feature available in Odoo which is used by many people but it is hidden because it is very important feature to create a list of activities and then apply in different different models so that Odoo calls is activity plans. So we do know like activity types, there are many in each and every model. So currently I am into CRM module and then I would like to create the activity plan. So if I go to activity plan, I can create new and I can give a name action to take on new leads, which will allow the team member to define a different type of, you know, uh, things like first take first email like uh, send introduction email and then I can define a user from my team and then I can say two days you know before the plan date or I can say after the plan date then I can say a to do or a meeting like personal meeting and I can say default user or at the time of launch I can define and that will be after plan date like four days and then I want to create a to-do list qualification and then I want to assign a fixed user after six days so these are my activities I have defined and then if I am giving into any leads then I can say I want to launch activity plan and then I will give a date of plan like the plan should start from 14th and I can have assigned over here and this three activity will be planned here which will indicate with the dates from the date of start like two days after this so if I choose 14th then the first activity will be planned on 16th rest after another two days another you know four days and six days so if I schedule Odoo automatically create entire plan for the designated person to execute this in its you know plan and that's how it will give three future activities inside CRM so this plan is very useful in every model now if I go to uh, let's say inventory you know we don't have any activity plan but yes in invoices we do have activity plans or in accounting let me check if we get an activity plan so not sure let me type activity plans so crm has sales has subscription has document has project has activity plan field service has an activity plan employee has an activity plan and recruitment has activity plan so these all models have an activity plan which we can launch and we can plan in advance because that is what a to do we need to plan so let's say i want to plan something in project so if i go into project so while you know project kick off i want to plan an activity and that model i can define whether on project or on task and then on the project i can define prepare list of pre requi and then at a the time of launch I can ask to give and then I can say two days before the plan date that is what I want my project manager to do before the date and then a kick off call I want to plan like after two days of the plan date and then I want to plan a meeting like regular stand-ups that will be 
you know after five days after the planned date so here we cannot set recurrence but yeah we can set days weeks or months in that and then i can say i want to have one more like upload document like project related docs and then i want to do you know after two weeks after the plan date so this is how i have planned while project kickoff on the project so if i go to project like this project one is there if i go inside the project it will take me over here but now what i need to do is i will go inside the project from setting and when i click on activity it will allow me to launch this plan now let's say if i am into task view and i am inside task and if I plan activity, you can see there is no activity plan over here because I haven't defined anything, but I have defined for project basis. So on project, I can define and call this template and then give a plan date like tomorrow I want to plan to start this activity. So two days before like yesterday, this documentation list has to be completed because that is what I have mentioned over there. So if I want to start my project on 20th, then by 18th, that has to be planned on 22, we can have a kickoff call, then so on. So if I choose my date to be, you know, 18th, then 16 and 20 will be, uh, you know, the dates where we need to plan the activity and I can assign a user and that user will get entire planning based on everything. And now in the project also, they can see four future activities has been given and that's how they can see the list of things to do inside the project so that's how we can see like entire activity and its plan so now activity types are many and activity plans are the configurable plans and then inside my project if i go here then i can see from here what to do as well as I can go here and see what to do. Okay, so if I say here a call due in eight days, then a meeting and upload document after you know two weeks from now, and then to do like 16th, I have to collect you know prerequisite on 23rd. We need to do a regular standard. So that's how the planner will work in Odoo over here. So very good feature, very useful feature. And then I'm again going into activity plans and you can see all this model have activity plans which we can configure for each and every you know module crm sales subscription document project field service recruitment and employees so a predefined various activity plan can be launched immediately and assigned to a designated person to the plan so you don't need to go each and every activity because you have planned to qualify your lead you have planned to execute the project you have planned to execute entire field service task that can be configured over here and then you can launch as and when needed. Hope this will help many people to configure and use this very small but important feature in their journey. Thank you guys. Good day.